Hello, peoples. Good morning, or good afternoon, or good evening, good night, whatever it is in your time, or whenever you're watching this. Today, we're going to do another tapping video that I think is going to help a lot of you with your manifesting your desires because a lot of you are getting trapped in this I want I really want want this to happen and you're getting too much in the wanting like I really you're thinking from the version of you that wants it instead of shifting into the the I have it already that version of you that has it is experiencing it now so you could call it stepping into the wish fulfilled but I'm just gonna call it the having state I have this thing or I am this thing same I have I am same same shit right <laughs> I'm not gonna do too much pre talk this time around because I think we all know what it is and um, we all obviously if you're watching this channel you all know about law of assumption and you know how to manifest basically you know you've got to shift into the wish field or shift into the having state and you know think as though uh, it's already happening now so without further ado let's start um, now I'm gonna keep looking down because I have a sort of script um, and dot points on my iPad down here so if I'm looking down that's how, why um, you don't have to repeat all of the words that I'm saying but I do want you to really think as I'm talking you can obviously say the words but what I want you to be doing is thinking about what I'm saying and embodying what I'm actually saying because it's your thoughts that are creating sometimes you can say words but you can be thinking a different thing now I know there's some people out there that go that's not true but I can tell you as a person with ADHD I can be thinking five things but you know but whatever's coming out of my mouth is not correlating right so make sure you are thinking it in in your head not just verbalizing it okay all right take a deep breath in and out starting on the karate shop point even though I really 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 want this thing so bad I still choose to love and accept myself with or without this thing even though I don't have this thing that I really want there must be some part of me that's blocking it or I'm missing something or I'm just causing resistance otherwise I'd have it already right I'm going to acknowledge that resistance or the block and love and accept myself anyway last one on here even though I can't seem to just step into this relaxed state of having you know the wish fulfilled I'm gonna decide that it's okay because I love and accept myself anyway moving to the top of the head I really want this I want this so bad it it hurts I can feel the desire burning in my belly I want this so badly but there must be some part of me that's holding me back some somehow there must be some part of me that's doubting I could be wavering and I'm not even realizing it maybe I'm just questioning what the end state really feels like maybe I just don't know if I'm doing it right and here brotherline maybe I'm just conditioning what the end would feel like maybe I'm thinking what it should feel like instead of just letting it come naturally at the top but it's time that I let all of this go and I just lean into trust trusting in my own ability to create trusting that whatever the end state I step into today will be enough that I am more than enough to do this I can do this I am choosing to let go of doubts I am choosing to let go of any resistance at all 
I'm choosing to let go of whatever is blocking me from stepping into the state right now. I am allowing myself to lean into trust. I'm giving myself permission. Up the top. I am allowing myself to feel like I already have it. I'm choosing to trust in my power as a creator. As I've been creating my whole entire life anyway, it's natural. Why am I making such a big deal of this? I am choosing to feel like I have this now. I am giving myself permission to step into the wish fulfilled. I am giving myself permission to feel relaxed and calm, knowing that what I want is already mine. It's mine already. I'm allowing myself to feel this now. All right. I want you to answer these questions that I am going to ask out loud or by yourself. How different does my world look now that I have this, this thing? Think about it. How different does your world look? Just keep tapping as you're thinking. <laughs> what am I seeing? What am I seeing now that I have this thing? What's different? What am I hearing? Think about it and tap at the same time. What am I hearing now that I have this thing? What are people saying to me now that I have this thing? What are your friends saying to you? What are your parents saying to you? What's your partner saying to you? Just think about all the things people would say to you once you've had this thing. Just think about it. Which one of my friends would I tell first? And how, how am I telling them? What would I say? Who'd be the first person I tell? And what are they saying back to you? When you tell them, what are they saying back to you? Think about it. Actively think about how or what, how would you would tell them what they'd say back to you. Who else would I tell? Who else would I tell? So what am I doing on a normal day now that I have this thing? Like on an everyday, you know, normal day, where would I be going? What would I be doing? What would I be thinking? Just think about who you'd be on a normal day if you've got this thing. Keep tapping. Because if I had this thing, just be a natural part of my life right now right like now that I'm thinking about it so hard I can't even recall the old me that didn't have this thing it just feels completely normal this is who I am now I have a calm relaxed knowing that this is who I am this is who I'm choosing to be now and anything that comes up that's not in alignment with this new person that I am now, I'm just going to ignore it. Like it doesn't exist. Because it's not me. It's not who I am anymore. Now, what I want you to do is I want you to state three times who you are now. I have whatever it is you have. Or I am and tap at the same time. I am now and say it three times. I have, I am, I have, or I am. I'm a master of manifesting. I have manifested whatever it is. Say it three times because three times is the trinity number. We get taught in hypnotherapy school that we're meant to suggest three times all the time. Three is a magic number. Say it again. Trinity is three. Say it one more time and then stop. Take a deep breath in and out. Now tell me how you feel. And hopefully this tapping video has done exactly what it's intended to do and you feel a lot more calmer, 
Of course, if you need to repeat this over and over, please do because it's only going to affect you more and more and more and get you further and further into the state like you're chipping away uh, and the more times you get into that state and just start imagining and thinking like being that person now and telling anyone in their environment who they are and what's happened you're already being that person and that's what we want you to be that person now all right have an awesome day and i will see you next time see you bye